guys. How y'all doing today? We're back here <laughs> on the road. It's Sunday, um, November the 15th. And we are almost to our destination. We're hauling cattle for the neighbors out to Whitewood Livestock. And we've got a friggin' problem with the lights on our trailer. Nothing wants to work right. Bought a new plug and wired it the way it's supposed to be wired, but like spliced the new plug into because it had a little bit of cord on it also. And they're not, I think the wires on the trailer, are, they didn't wire the trailer the way, uh, the way uh, I would wire a trailer, or the way there's the new trailers are wired. How's that sound? So it's gonna take a little bit of uh, trial and an error and a light tester to find out what lights are what and get everything installed properly. I bought a new breakaway complete with battery kit. I bought a junction box. So I gotta get and put uh, proper ends on all the lights. And then, or on the all the wires I mean, not the lights. And yeah, but anyway, that's what we're doing here right now. We're getting these cattle hauled into Whitewood and for the neighbor. And yeah, that'll make him happy. So sales on Tuesday. So we'll bring you guys back in a little bit. Alrighty guys, well we're home and uh, I just whipped this gate together so there it is right there she's like 10 foot 9 long it's uh, there's two of these gates they fit into a whole 11 or 21 foot 6 so I'll have just a little bit of overlap which is fine by me so I got this side all fitted and welded up and we got to flip it over and weld the other side but before I do that I'm gonna back that sucker in here and we're gonna figure out what the hell's going on with these goddamn lights so let's get her in here and see if we can't figure out what's going on so yeah bring it back in a bit alrighty so we're backed into the shop here now the plug that was on this cord Something went wrong, it failed, it wasn't working no more at all. So I bought that plug, which had a six foot lead out on it, and I figured no problem, we'll just wire these wires to these wires, splice them together, yahoo, right? Thumbs up? Yeah, not so much. Cause now when I hit the brake, all the lights come on. When you turn your marker lights on, none of them come on when you turn the right hand signal light on all the lights start lighting up so something's definitely screwy in this trailer and I can't figure that out because I never had an issue before so yeah we got our work cut out for us so anyway with this light I'm gonna end up taking this friggin tailgate off so I got more room in here there ain't much room in here but anyways um, when you're plugged in, that light, that plug lights up to the functions that are working. And I don't understand why that one is on. I got to get in there closer and figure it out. So back in a bit. Alrighty guys, well we got her figured out. So this cord that goes from the truck right there all the way around to here and then this cord that was in the trailer when I bought it the wiring is different okay so this is my left hand turn and on the cord to the truck it's red coming off the truck it's red white to white is still my ground uh, over here brown to green is my uh right hand turn 
And green to brown is the left hand turn. And blue to red is my brake. Just a little bit screwy, that's for sure. But we got her figured out. This yellow one on this side is a backup lights, which I do not have. And black to on here, this black is for a uh, to charge for charging like a 12 volt battery pack, like on a camper. But I'm not using it on this side. There's no need for it over here. So, I guess we've got her figured out. So, theoretically, I don't need this, and I don't need this, and I don't need this. I need all the others on this particular trailer. What a son of a gun. So, I bought one of these, and I'm going to install it. And we, after that, we are going to what? We are... Uh, I'm going to have to make this cord a little longer with this stuff. So I'm going to splice everything here. I got these solder slash heat shrink connectors. I'm going to put those in here and then tape everything up really good. And then we'll run that cord inside and install that junction box and go from there. That's the plan at this point. Talk to you guys later. So you guys can make this out here. So you just heat her up good, right like that, and it shrinks it down. Now this one over here, I haven't done it. I pinched the solder right in the center. Now I'm going to take my little torch, click down, start. Try not to overheat it, this little piss ass shit. I give it extra in the center where the solder is. Oh, might have overheated a little bit there. Just like that. So that one I got it a little bit too warm, but I think we'll be okay. So, so that's how that works. Now I just got to do the brake one back here. And then we'll get some tape on her back in a bit. Alrighty guys, well, lights are on on the truck. Everything's working across the bottom. Everything's working across the top. Now for the trailer. Woohoo! We got marker lights. And if our flashers are working, that means my signals are working. And I got the flashers on. That's working. Up there's all working. That guy right there is on. And that one there is on. So our lights are all working. Now, go to the cab. And that's working. I'll touch the brake. And I should be able to see a brake light light up. Put this stuff away in the pocket. There we go. Shut that off. Yep, you see that? It lit up there. So that means the brake lights are working too. Right on. Just what you want to see, right guys? 
So I'll show you on the inside what we ended up doing. Ah. I gotta put the cover on here yet. So this trailer never ever had a junction box for the wiring. So, there, there's the junction box. And then from the battery pack, breakaway pack, I ran an extension wire from it by itself to in here. And that's this red one right here. And that's what it looks like inside there. I got a couple extra rubber grommets. I'll just leave those in there. We'll get the cover on. Like that. That goes on like that. We'll just screw her all down and we're good to go. Anyway, with that guys, give us the old thumbs up, comment, subscribe. Fun, fun, fun. Let's get her done.